ever thought that almost everything can wait and we don't have to rush to do anything unless there is an immediate danger, of course. Hi, I'm Dr. Araya, your rapid transformational coach in personal development, relationships, and conscious parenting. And I have only one mission, and that is to empower you to live your authentic self and your full potential with ease, grace, and joy. And I hope I can do that a little bit today with today's Art of Living in Joy tip. Today, I'd like to tell you about an invaluable lesson I learned from a life predicament by alchemizing a problem to an opportunity for a spiritual and psychological evolution. I rose above a traumatizing scamming incident several months ago. The immediate lesson I learned from this experience was that haste and fast reactions are almost never necessary. Of course, if your child is jumping to the street, be quick and grab him. But almost any other situation can greatly benefit from a pause. When I got a call from a fake authority on that day, I panicked. He said that I had signed a subpoena to appear in court as a witness for one of my clients. And since I did not show up, they had a warrant for my arrest. When I said I never signed any form, he said I could go to the police station to verify that the signature on the paper was not mine. When I said, okay, I'm coming, he said I needed to put a bond first, otherwise they would arrest me. I know to some of you this might sound ridiculous, but because I panicked and did not pause to connect to my inner knowing, I fell into their trap that kept me going for 10 hours. If only I had paused and put the phone on mute to talk to my husband without the guy knowing since he had initially scared me not to do so because there was a gag order on this. And yes, he told me to Google gag order. Scammers who use fear are experts at activating our fight or flight mechanism which shuts down our inner knowing as well as our higher functioning part of our brain. That is why it is essential to take a pause take deep breaths and tell ourselves this is not an emergency or this is not a life or death situation so we can use our higher brain and the wisdom in our heart to proceed. I have one more precious lesson to share in my next video. I just hope this video not only offered you a wisdom nugget but brought awareness to the increasing scamming incidents. Know that no company and no government agency will ever ask you to purchase gift cards. I'm pretty level-headed and have turned down hundreds of scamming calls, but I eventually fell for one. Know that they either use greed or fear. Therefore, be super vigilant and don't forget to pause. And oh, last but not least, if you fall into their trap, don't feel guilty or stupid. It is just a waste of your life force. I'd love to know what you think about this tip. Comment below and let me know. If you're ready to cultivate more empowerment and more joy in your life and the life of your family, your corporation, or your school, and you're looking for someone to be your partner in this path, book your free call at draraya.com. I cannot wait to chat with you and serve you. All my love.